think one of the things that's so exciting about computer science is that, you know, whether or not you want to do entertainment, music, film, biology, uh, educational technology, they all require computer science. One of the areas I'm particularly excited about is educational data mining, where you can look at the data for, say, thousands of students and learn about what people are learning. Uh, neuroscience, huge need for computer science. So just every area of society, you can apply computer science in it. I think the biggest problem in recruiting girls into STEM fields is that there's a big difference between recruiting girls into biology and chemistry where there are just tons of girls compared to recruiting them into computer science, physics, engineering. But I'd say for the, for the areas where there's difficulty, it's because their image of what those fields are like is just not correct. It's, you know, the, the sort of image is that this is boring, it's antisocial, it's uh, the kind of thing no person in the right mind would find interesting. And when you can actually get them to get engaged in it and find out how much fun it is and how much you can do with it, then you get traction. I think the best way to instill an interest in math and science for young women, girls, is to make it lots of fun and to emphasize the creative and problem solving aspects of it because there are very few young women who don't want to be creative and most of them also love solving problems and puzzles. So if you can put those two things together, that's usually um, something that will get girls and young women interested. I think one of the things that we have learned from watching our students is that young women women of all ages are much more likely to ask for help early on and be willing to collaborate on things, whereas uh, young men and then older men as well are much more likely to try and tough it out on their own. And so I think what happens when you add women to the mix, you tend to get more collaboration, more communication, and just a more diverse set of ideas about how to pro approach things. And it's not that one is better than the other, it's that when you mix the two together, it's better.